three, two, one, and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Discovery with the Hubble Space Telescope, our window on the universe. The launch and deployment of the Hubble Space Telescope in April 1990 marked the most significant advance in astronomy since Galileo's telescope, making great strides and dazzling us with spectacular images. Our view of the universe and our place within it has never been the same since then. On March 7, 2021, the Hubble telescope entered safe mode after a software error. Four days later, to the relief of all, the Hubble returned to carry out scientific operations, letting us know that it still has many years left, in which it will continue to show us spectacular images of the cosmos. In this video, we'll see interesting discoveries that the Hubble telescope has made recently, and we'll also see some impressive images that it has captured. This is a dazzling galaxy. It's beautiful, big and blue. This galaxy is a part spiral that spans an immense 200,000 light years across and is approximately 100 million light years distant. The light of this galaxy took 100 million years to reach us. Wonder how scientists know the distance and size of galaxies? Astronomers have developed various techniques to indirectly measure the great distances between Earth and galaxies. In many cases, these methods are mathematically complex and involve extensive computer modeling. So I'll leave more information in the description. Astronomers measure the distance to a galaxy by studying the light output of bright stars in it. To measure the distance to a galaxy, they try to find stars in it whose absolute light output can be measured. They can then determine how far away the galaxy is by looking at the brightness of the stars. And the conventional way of measuring diameter involves summing the total light from the galaxy through a very large aperture, so that the total light measure does not depend very much on the particular size of the aperture used. The spiral arms of NGC 2336 glow with young stars visible in their brilliant blue light. In contrast, the rather central part of the galaxy is dominated by older stars. This galaxy has only experienced one supernova. It's the only supernova observed since its discovery in 1876. This image presents in great detail a really beautiful and imposing galaxy, against a background full of more distant galaxies. Located 41 light years away, around a red dwarf star, is the rocky Earth sized exoplanet GJ 1132b. Recently, a group of scientists using the Hubble Space Telescope were surprised to find evidence that this planet may have lost its original atmosphere. But then came a second one, which contains a toxic mixture of hydrogen, methane, ammonia, and hydrogen cyanide, with a hydrocarbon mist. Hubble detected the fingerprints of these gases as light from its star filtered through the exoplanet's atmosphere. The planet is too small compared to a galaxy to be imaged by Hubble. In this artistic representation, we can see what could be happening in this remote world. And how was the new atmosphere formed? This exoplanet has intense volcanic activity. Astronomers theorized that hydrogen from the original atmosphere was absorbed by the planet's molten magma mantle and is now being slowly released by volcanism to form a new atmosphere. 
the gravitational pull of another planet in the system likely fractures the surface of this exoplanet, giving it the appearance of a cracked eggshell. Located 17 million light years away is NGC 4826, also known as the Black Eye Galaxy, because of the dark band of dust that runs along one side of its bright core. This impressive spiral galaxy is known to astronomers for its strange internal motion. Gases in the outer and inner regions of this galaxy are spinning in opposite directions, which could be related to a recent merger. New stars are forming in the region, where the counter-rotating gases collide. HH46 and HH47 are two herbic harrow objects that are located at a distance of more than 1400 light years from Earth. These objects take the form of thin jets of matter that float between the gas and the surrounding stars. They are some of the rarest sights in the night sky. Flows of matter about 10 light years across were ejected from the newborn star and propelled at speeds of more than 150 kilometers per second. Upon reaching the surrounding gas, the collision created the bright shockwaves seen here. What looks like two bright eyes and a lopsided smile in this recent Hubble image are the early stages of a collision between two galaxies. The full view is 109,000 light years across, which is roughly the diameter of our Milky Way. The orange color corresponds to the brightness of the aged red stars in the two galaxies which only have a little spiral structure. Researchers suggest that what resembles a smile may just be the beginning of the process of building a spiral galaxy. Most likely it was formed when interstellar gas was compressed when the two galaxies began to merge. I hope you don't mind my peculiar accent. Thank you for watching. This is Julio from Sci Media. Until next time.